The summer holidays are here and there's no better time to explore your own backyard this festive break. If you're looking for an affordable day out where you might just discover something new, then set aside a day to visit Whiteman Park. It serves as an ideal spot for a laid-back celebration or an enjoyable day out, with all things recreation, conservation and education at its core. With an abundance of things to see, do and explore, it caters to everyone, regardless of who you're visiting with. A great place to start is the Visitor Information Centre. A stop here will help you map out your day of discovery. Its location in the village will allow you to stop into the specialty shops in the mall and pick out some art, crafts, pottery or the kids' favourite, lollies. Now, a visit here doesn't have to be expensive. There are so many free activities you can do in the park. You can take a walk through nature, enjoy a picnic, bring your binoculars for some bird watching, bring the dog for a walk, the kids can cool off in the water playground, or visit the magical Piers Place and climb the lighthouse. How good. If you love to discover history and heritage, then you're in luck. With three museums here in the park, you won't be disappointed. First up, rev the engine and check out the Motor Museum of WA, home to more than 200 vehicles ranging from the horse-drawn era to today. And make sure you don't miss the pride of the museum, the 2014 Red Bull Racing Formula One car driven by Daniel Ricciardo. For a change of pace, jump into the Tractor Museum. Here you can see, hear and smell the machinery that played such an important part in the early life of our state. And last but not least, Revolution's Transport Museum will open your eyes to some of the fascinating land transport stories and technological developments that have shaped our past and will impact our future. Here you can learn about how all forms of transport have changed the lives of West Aussies. Kids will love the interactive displays. You can climb aboard a horse-drawn buggy or jump the driver's seat of an EJ Holden. Aside from the man-made, Whiteman Park is an amazing piece of bushland so close to the city and it plays an important role in the conservation of our native flora and fauna with the aim to recreate the bushland to that of pre-European settlement. The Woodland Reserve, which encompasses more than 500 hectares of natural and rehabilitated bushland, is home to the critically endangered Woylie, Quenda and short-beaked echidna, to name a few. You can book a guided tour and get up close with nature on a nocturnal Woylie walk and find these cute little guys by torchlight. And aside from the park's primary school education programs, there are lots of incidental and fun ways to learn a little bit more about this amazing piece of metropolitan bushland. The children's forest is full of interpretive signage about our native bushland and its inhabitants, or find out more about the man who the park was named after, Lou Whiteman, around Muscle Pool. This is a great day out for everyone. And one last thing, if you have friends or relatives visiting this Christmas, then make sure you check out the iconic WA native Christmas tree or mudger in all its fiery bloom. Merry Christmas.